Hello, and welcome to another TPOS tutorial. In this video, I will demonstrate how to make a request for time to pay arrangement. First, you need to log in with your correct user ID and password. Once logged into your account, select the request tile. Here, you'll see multiple request types. Select the time to pay arrangement tile. Now select request for time to pay arrangement. Once selected, a set of instructions will appear. Please read these instructions carefully before proceeding. Check the box, once you have read and understood. Then click continue to the next step to proceed to the TTPA application form. Here, you will need to state the reason for requesting for time to pay arrangement. Select the tax type. Note that this drop-down will only list the tax types you're registered for. Let's choose service turnover tax. You will also need to select the reason for extension. For this tutorial, I'll choose cash flow problems. Additional information on the reason for extension is mandatory for you to fill. For this example, we'll enter cash flow problems due to COVID-19. Now click continue to next step. The system will pre-populate all outstanding liabilities for the tax type selected. It is your responsibility to check if all liabilities are correct before proceeding to the next step. Step. Here you are required give a duration for payment from 2 to 12 months only. The system will automatically reflect the down payment amount based off the down payment rate and duration you've selected. Note that the minimum down payment rate is 10%. If you select a rate below 10% the system will prevent you from going to the next step. Once you are satisfied with your down payment amount then proceed to the next step to upload your necessary documents to assist in processing your application. Here, the recent bank statements field is mandatory. Proceed to the next step, once all your documents have been uploaded. Enter your TIN and select a designation. Check the box, I declare that the information in this application is true and correct in every detail. There is also an option to add notes if need be. Click Submit to complete the process. A confirmation note appears with the reference number, which will be sent to your email, and it can also be downloaded. Once your forms are processed by FRCS, the confirmation note will be available on your correspondence tile. This brings us to the end of the request for time to pay arrangement. We hope that you have been able to follow through. Thank you for watching and please stay tuned for more tutorial videos.